After setting the unit, you can adjust the pan tension. This is done by placing the safety nail, which should be always in place when setting, and pressing down on the pan. You can tighten the pan up or loosen it with a simple adjustment of the pan adjustment bolt. Try it again, put your hammer in, reset. This keeps the sled from firing back, which is easier on the unit and easier on the springs every time you adjust. More time, once you feel it's adjusted, remove the nail, let it go back, now you're ready to set the unit. Universal Selective Catch is a tool that can be used on most any animal. This is showing a trail set. Dirt is removed approximately the same depth as a unit. The unit is then placed within this depression. Spikes are placed either four around the base or two and one at the end. Place your hammer firmly in the critter sled and with one quick motion set it. Make sure your snare chain is not kinked. If it is, it can be just swiveled around to straighten it out. The snare loop is then placed upon the four vertical wires. And make sure your chain is straight. The snare keeper from the pulley is placed in the sled. And the other snare keeper can be placed on either side, depending on the side you're setting the snare from, but make sure that the curve of the snare is on the same side as the keeper pole. The snare can then either be staked down or hooked to an extension cable via a quick link. Snug up the quick link with a pair of pliers or a wrench. Make sure your snare is flat. The trigger cover is placed on. There is a wedge underneath and then this side towards snare. This is very important for that to function as the trigger block slides back. It will raise the cover. The snare is then buried. Careful not to have too much sticks or debris over the loop and never use grass to cover because the grass will get caught in the snare and the animal's foot can slip out. Here again, careful not to put too many sticks or much debris within the snare loop. Stepping sticks are placed on each side of the unit. Small sticks can be drove in to keep the sticks from rolling on top of the unit so that an animal kick them. And the snare is then finished getting blocked in. Do not put too much weight on the side that the cover is to keep, might prevent it from coming up. An 11 inch loop gives plenty of area for an animal to step on coming through. Once the animal is caught, the snare then detaches from the unit. And in most cases, the unit will just stay in the ground. When placing the snare, make sure your chain is straight your snare is completely down. When putting the cover on, always make sure that the lock is in front of the cover 
so the cover does not prevent the lock from sliding forward. Select a catch is equipped with two clean out holes on the bottom plus the opening on the top to remove most debris. Never put your fingers within the trigger housing, especially when set. It can also be flushed out with water from time to time if need be.